Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be going over uh, saving and loading game variables if you want to create a simple saving and loading system for your game. So we're going to go take a look at the save data script and uh, at the start we're going to call onload and on save enabled. So first we'll go look at onload. So when your game starts, you want to load all the variables that were saved um, previously when you were playing. So it will take your player health dot p. So that's our static variable that we created in player health um, corrects p, which is zero right now but it will go and retrieve the int for um, correct p. <coughs> so our next thing is auto save enabled which is another function that will be constantly called. This is for a uh, just an auto save script so every five seconds it'll save all the variables that you have listed so you don't have to go through and uh, actually click a button to save but I mean there's a very simple way to uh, do that just attach that script onto a button so every time you click the button it calls this and it'll save your game so we will look at the on save function so it's pretty much storing our correct p so it's grabbing uh, this variable and it's storing it in here because you can see that correct p is in all these so so that's pretty much the basics of the save script so what you want to do is go and throw throw the save script uh, or save data somewhere I just threw it on my player so we'll go in here real quick and you can see it's already set to 10 I was testing it a little bit earlier but we'll attack alright so we have 20 right now we'll go out load back in and oh it must have not been five seconds we'll hang on for a second and then we load back up and you can see that our XP is still at 20 it's not at zero right now so that's pretty much how you save and load data using uh, those types of functions.